Hello, it's Kelly from the County Grant Public Library again. Today we're doing black and white again. Um, but this is my version of how to do tree rings. Again, it's just a simple way of doodling. Um, I know we've done this before, we've done it on a couple projects. But this is just, just another version of how to doodle and make a beautiful piece of art. So you can do it black on white, white on black, you can choose black and have whatever color you want. But in your kit you're going to get um, canvas, paint, and a paint marker. Okay. So if you've never worked with a paint marker, it's kind of a fun little thing to work with. Um, give it a good shake and you have to activate it. Um, so you're just going to activate it by shoving down okay, until your paint starts to come out. There we go, we got it going. Um, so I just started my project with just a simple circle. Um, and I, on the first one I just did one circle, but for another one, let's do another one. So just choose a nice circle. Um, I'm using marker here only so that you can see it. I would generally use a pencil. Um, I don't know if you can see that or not. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that's where your starting point will be. Um, I, because I've done swirlies over here, I'm going to do swirlies again. So this marker, it's kind of a funny little thing to work with. It's not white white. They call it white, but it's not a solid white. And every so often it will stop working. Don't freak out about that. Because it will need to be reactivated again. So I'm going to give it a good shake every so often, just to keep the paint flowing, okay? So what I've done is I've literally just started in a circle and start working my way out. So you can decide if you want to make this come this way a lot or go that way a lot. So the next round you can just do, nice. So you can do this with anything. Um, if you want, you can do black and white. You can even do paint. Paint's actually fun to work with. It will actually change the look of your canvas because it's actually a different color of white. As you can see, I've played with this one. Then all this section is marker. And as you can see, I've added white paint. So it changes the texture of, um, or the whiteness of the canvas. So you might want to mix it up. Or if you did one of our old projects and you've got that gold um, paint left, add some gold. Wouldn't that be pretty? So have fun. Uh, there's no pattern involved in this one. This is all your imagination. Thanks. We'll see you soon. Bye.